Until Death Do Us Part is directed by Timothy Woodward Jr. and produced by Final Destination creator Jeffrey Reddick. An action-packed black comedy horror with a few tricks up its sleeve. When a bride-to-be runs away from her wedding, she unknowingly sets up a chain of events that leads her down a bloody and violent path, fending off seven angry groomsmen and facing off against the groom himself in a deadly game of survival. Right from the get-go, you can tell something's off here, something's amiss. But since this is a slow burn movie, things will reveal themselves gradually. You just have to be a little patient. To me, Till Death Do Us Part feels like a clever combination of your next, ready or not, and runaway bride. If you know nothing about the plot beforehand, the opening sequence can be a little bit confusing, in the sense that nothing can prepare you for what's coming next. The build-up becomes key to the storytelling. Almost the entire movie happens at night time. Reddish, bluish and greenish tones are a constant presence on pretty much every scene. Besides, this minimal lighting scheme enhances the tension of the environment. The fight sequences are quick, intense and relentless. Oh, and super gory! So if you're into that kind of thing, this movie is just right up your alley. The deaths are also creative enough to keep them from feeling boring or repetitive. To me, the best man is also the best character. And the one with the best lines for sure. Cam Jigande provides a lot of flair to the character. Jason Patrick also does a really great job in this movie even though he may go unnoticed for most of the audience. I am not entirely sure why, but there seems to be something strangely captivating about watching a bride going full survivor killer mode and kicking groomsman's butt. Till the Doer's part manages to capture the essence of that idea and turn it into a solid piece of entertainment. So I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10. Thank you guys as always for watching. If you happen to see Till Death Do Us Part, please feel free to return to this review and just drop a comment below. I will continue doing both English and Spanish reviews on my channel. So if you would like to subscribe, that would actually be awesome. And hopefully, I'll see you next time.